Question number five, the Honourable Pete Hodson. Mr. Speaker, my question is to the Minister of Immigration and reads: On what day was Immigration New Zealand's investigation file concerning Kanwaljeet Bakshi made over to the New Zealand Police? The Honourable Jonathan Coleman. Mr. Speaker, I am advised that the case was first referred to the police on the 20th of July 2009, and the file was subsequently handed over on the 28th of July. The Honourable Pete Hodson. When a copy of the first investigation report was made public, why did the Minister then ask his officials at the Department of Labour to investigate why the official information request had not gone through his office? The Honourable Jonathan Coleman. Mr Speaker, well, in my office, as in yours, when you were a Minister... Order. The Speaker may well have been a Minister, but okay. right now he is not. Mr Speaker... Uh, it's a common approach in ministers' office under offices uh, under this government, as it was under the last, that ministers operate under a no surprises policy with regards to their departments. The Honourable Pete Hodson. Mr. Speaker. The Honourable Pete Hodson. Uh, does the minister accept that the second investigation into Kanmaljit Bakshi? only arose because officials did release information concerning the first investigation to the New Zealand Herald, and that, had that information not been released, no second investigation would be underway. The Mr. Speaker, Coleman. the consistent approach right throughout this matter is that if uh, information comes to light which warrants further investigation, Immigration New Zealand should proceed in that manner, and I have made that very clear to them. The Honourable Pete Hodson. Will any future official information requests concerning Kanwaljeet Bakshi be handled by departmental officials alone, or will he continue to require his officials to pass any such requests to his ministerial office for his personal perusal? The Honourable Jonathan Coleman. Mr Speaker. All OIA requests that go to the department, apart from requests of a very minor statistical nature, come uh, to the minister's office attention under the no surprises policy. The Honourable Pete Hodson. Why was a planned interview of departmental? I'm sorry. I'll start again. Why was a planned interview of Department of Labour officials arranged in June? by the New Zealand Herald, called off by his political adviser, Mr James Watson. The Honourable Jonathan Coleman. Uh, it wasn't called off. The department can interview who they like, when they like, with regards to any investigation. Question number... Sup Mr Supplementary, oh, I beg your pardon, the Honourable Pete Hodson. Does the Minister understand that the more he seeks to vet official information requests regarding his colleague, Kanwaljeet Bakshi, and the more he interferes with the free access of the media to his officials regarding his colleague, Kanwaljeet Bakshi, the more likely that it is that he will be interviewed as, and he will be viewed as protecting his colleague, Kanwaljeet Bakshi. The Honourable Mr. Jonathan Speaker. Coleman. Well, the member over there is making an allegation, and I'd invite him to make it outside the House.